Well, I seem to have alarmed hundreds of thousands of people with my video on dementia and how people die at the end. Well, I mentioned that people are no longer able in the end stage of dementia to feed themselves. They get fed, but eventually they're not able to swallow. Now, they cannot sustain their nutrition at that point, but even if we put a feeding tube into them, it's not a story about nutrition. And this is what I wanna clarify. With dementia, there are global changes that happen with the brain tissue over the 10 to 15 year experience of Alzheimer's, which is the most common type of dementia. The brain essentially starts shrinking. It doesn't work anymore. This is why the person can no longer swallow. Even if we were able to put a feeding tube in someone and artificially feed them, it doesn't change the fact that their brain is deteriorating and that's what they're dying from. So feeding them and giving them more calories does not actually prolong the dementia. It doesn't keep them alive longer and it actually doesn't keep them safer from aspiration pneumonia or from uh, choking. It's, it's no better for quality of life and it doesn't keep people alive longer. So there is no rule for a feeding tube. Once someone is no longer able to swallow, that is a signal that they are actually dying from the shrinking and the global effect on their brain. It's not dying of starvation.